starts with putting the wood down. My cutters, put the wood down, quick. Watch this one. If the wood isn't fell correctly, you start losing money as soon as you start putting a saw on the tree. Well, Gabe figured that maybe he might want another set of eyes out here to check on the cutters. I needed a set of eyeballs over there to tell me what was going on, and I trust him to tell me that. Uh, it's a pretty good hike up here, so, you know, it takes a while to get up in here. This is an old guy line stump from back in the old days. And the way it's notched, they must have had a yard or somewhere up over that way. I just love finding this kind of <laughs> Try to figure out what they did. Envision where the old timers decided they'd set up the yard from. And the wood that they took, small trees even. I think what I'm gonna do is just head right back through this stand and timber. Get back on the backside and see what they're doing down there. need to talk to you. What's going on? Got one to come down and just look and see what the wood looked like, see how it was getting laid. OK. The cutters have to lay it what we call in lead. They have to lay it so that it's pointing towards the line. Gabe knows you're fighting it, even trying to get it on the ground. It's steep, a lot of loose dirt. But I'm looking at it, and hey, it looks great to me. We'll be on the butts all the way. That's all he wants. I've been bucking the These wood. These guys are real professional. When we change roads every time, we want to be on the butts every time. He's got it laying as good as any I've ever seen. I, all I can say is I'll tell Gabe, give him a good report, and you guys just carry on. When I get back, I can tell Gabe, it's going to look really good, and we can yard it all by the butt, so we'll be fine. You don't have to worry about it. 